Hey everyone, welcome back to Carrots and Olives. My name is Brittany and today we are going to be doing day 22 of 30 inks, 30 days. Realizing now I am not prepared once again. Why do I do this to myself? Okay, so day 21 turned out really good. I think this ink is so gorgeous i need to it's definitely going on my list of inks to buy and i will talk about that list in another video and perhaps show you what i've like agreed to getting with myself i have to make my list first of all and then um, decide if it if i can even get all the inks at one location that's another thing. And then even um, deciding if I want to get that many bottles. I mean, I already have a subscription of inks that um, with, you know, Atlas Stationer, which, you know, it's getting a bit obsessive, like it's getting a bit much. And I need to think of the right time to just stop. That's for another video. Here is that swatch card, gorgeous gorgeous and I'm ready to move on I have my swatch I need to put in the day but with a ballpoint so I'll use this one I just draw this in it doesn't take more than a few seconds Twenty two. The pen I'm going to use today is my Lebon Cambridge uh, three two five, and the ink is going to be. Let's see. I don't know what I want to do. What do I want to do? I've already did a purple. I think I might try like a deep blue if I try this. No, no, no. Try this one. Yeah. Ooh, this is going to be super light. Okay, that's fine. It is what it is. Let's try all the, the inks that aren't uh, my favorite favorite that I know of. So these interesting inks. Okay, so this ink is called Waringal. Um, Don Quixote, Q-U-I-X-O. T E. How do you say that word? I'm just going to say Don Q. So let's just let that sit for a second. And then let's do my little Q tip sample. Let's see how this is going to go. Okay, at first it's like brown. My mind quickly thinks, is it gonna turn purple? No, it's still brown-ish. Yeah, it's like a, a light brown. Could be kind of like a purple. But it's more brown. Kind of a neutral color. So let's let that dry. I need to re-dip it. Whoa, this is dark. Hmm. 
I don't know if this is the true color or if my pen had some re residual ink left on the nib. Because this color doesn't quite match this color. <laughs> What's going on? Now, I thought the same thing about another ink. However, that ink was actually the true color. So I just threw out some of the ink, just a couple drops, um, to see. 30 inks. 30 days. September 22nd, 2023. And is Lebon three two five Cambridge? Ink. Oh, and I think this is yeah, this is in a fine. The ink is Waringal. Dawn Q. And, hmm, I know it's like a brown. It is a brown ink, more neutral. I think I would put it under like the more neutral category. It looks like there's some pink on this sheet. Lebon three two five Cambridge. And this is Wearingle Don Q Let's see how it looks on my Hobonichi. I don't know, what color does that look like to you? Um, I feel like it's closer to Monteverde Moonstone, wearing goals and Mina. Like it's kind of in that color category, but it has more of like a pinky or purpley feel to it. Okay, let's. Okay. All right, so we have the pen, we have my splatters. I did that off screen and then we have this sample card. It looks like brown and pink. It's really pretty actually. It's growing on me and I'm really liking this color. So it's definitely um, going in that possibility of, of buying a sample. If you have any questions, feel free to post it down in the comments below. I will catch you in video tomorrow for day 23. Have a good night.